on to our second fight of the evening in the NSAC 77 kilogram division. Introducing first in the blue corner, Lucas And we're on the way with our second fight. Lucas K versus Gawin Wyatt. Moved up to the NSAC division now. So uh, headshot standing and on the ground. Makes for a much more exciting fight. And already Wyatt, Wyatt catches left. him. Pushing him against the cage. Looks for a big, big takedown. Nice. Into half guard for Wyatt. Wyatt wants to free that leg now and uh, oh. hopefully rain some ground and pound down. Maybe get into full mount. Larger gloves. It's six six times. Six times yeah. gloves in the uh, and sack division. Wyatt trying to pull the right leg out, free himself of half guard. Working his leg through. There we and go. And passing to side. Nice. Wyatt con controlling the ground at the moment. Trapping the arm. Now he's able to round. Now he can head. There you go. There the heavy shot. The at the crucifix position. And Lucas out. Working for that crucifix again. Using that leg, the light, light the way he used, yeah. Just, and just traps some more big blows. That's, once you're in that position, it's he's in big trouble. To be, and the ref could, could stop this any minute in this position. 
Landing some heavy Got shots, nothing back. Hands, arms locked in. He's landing big left hands. He's in a world of trouble, basically. Full mount now. Into mount. Now we see the oh, big he's, shots. He's, he's Wyatt's hammering him into the right, face. Nothing's coming right. back. Referees Neil Hall taking a close look. More big right hands. Stop the fight. Neil Hall, stop the fight. I thought prematurely, personally. Uh, I can kind of see where Andy Green suffers from. <laughs> I can see where Neil stopped that. I mean, there must have been maybe 20 shots, 30 shots. Unanswered. But fighters like to lose, like to win. When they lose, they're always going to be disappointed. Of course, course. However it goes. Lucas very disappointed. He can't have a huge, he weren't defending himself successfully. He can't have a big argument on that. The ref could have let it go longer. The likelihood that the result would have been exactly the same. So. And still at an amateur level, the safety of the fighters is of the utmost importance. It's still experience for these guys for when they turn pro. Absolutely.